Hey guys, this is 182. Welcome back to Zoo Tycoon Complete Collection, which she's a witch. In the last part, we are continuing breeding the T-Rex. Uh, off camera, I prepared the last two exhibit spaces and replaced a number of dead animals. Because, well, they got old and died. Good news is, None died from, uh, from, uh, what's it called? Sickness. Just old age. Alright, so. <sighs> I think next to the Arctic Wolves, let's go with the Gray Wolves. Uh, yes, I think that's correct. Did I did I make my exhibit not big enough for this? <clears throat> no, it's fine. All right. First, okay. At first, I misread that as flesh water. That would be blood. Could you imagine if you could just like put like rivers of blood in Zoo Tycoon exhibits? Or actually if there was any blood at all. Alright. Dirt. Like, like, just imagine a tile called blood. Deciduous and coniferous floor. I want to know why the deciduous and the coniferous floor are so far away from the rainforest floor. Anyway, I'm not sure where I was going with blood. But, I don't know, maybe it's my morbid sense of humor. Uh -huh. Wait, really? There's too much dirt? I thought you guys also wanted grass. Yes, you do. Alright. Foliage, rocks, shelter. There we go, yeah. Shelter. Do you like the burrow? I don't think so. Oh, wait. Yeah, wolf family likes rock caves. You are in the way. You. Move. Rock cave. They like the Pacific dogwood tree. I know you're not happy. I am working on it right now. I know you're hungry and can't find. Oh! Oh, you're the Siberian tigers. Your zookeeper is just kind of neglectful. I don't know why they go hungry so much. And it's specifically the Siberian Tigers. Uh, maybe I'll have to take a look at where uh, all the fence, or all the exhibit openings are. And do you want a coniferous rock formation? Nope. How about rock? Do you want small rock? No. Oh, but it doesn't matter. Your suitability is at 100. That's fine. It's perfectly fine. 
Now before I build... Okay, what is going on with the Siberian Tigers? Who is assigned you... To the... Maybe... Doing that? Might help the AI. Because now they're all there. But th there shouldn't have been a problem in the first place. So I really, really don't know. Alright. And the last... That's okay, I still have Unicorn 4 is female and Unicorn 3 is male. I'm still good. Uh, one of the big hits was actually uh, one of the the uh, Unicorns died and I had to replace them. Unicorns are expensive. So... For the Ice Age, I'm thinking Saltwater Crocodile. Anyway, I'm thinking the saltwater crocodile. Yeah. I think that makes perfect sense in a... That's probably not nearly big enough, right? Oh no, it's fine. Sweet. All right, I'm approaching the point where I need to be a little bit finessing. You, over there. You, over there. Oop, too much, too much, too much. Panda caves available. Needs dirt. Why can't you find food? Alright, rocks and foliage. And they like seagrass? No, they like water reeds. bunch of water reeds. Oop. Too far. All right. And rocks. There are no water rocks, except for dinosaur digs. You don't happen to like this, do you? You do! But only that much. Do you want a large rock? Do you want a medium rock? Oh, suitability 88. Yeah, I think going with the dinosaur digs rock is not the way to do it, given that saltwater crocs existed before dinosaur digs. Really? Really? 
No, you're okay. You're hungry and can't find food. That's not a problem. Suitability eighty-eight. And they don't want any more salt water. They don't want any more dirt. They don't want sand. <sighs> I think I need to make the exhibit bigger. I think that's what the issue is. And that ought to be pretty darn close to what they need. Alright, so they want... First off, am I right on the... Nope. They want a little bit more dirt now. Uh, foliage... Weird. Alright, now that really didn't work. It says water reed is their favorite. I wonder if I could... Yeah. Suitability 89. Suitability of 91. Uh, um, where's the, oh, anyway, AI is not getting it. All right, so I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 13, 14. Okay, who is not in a suitable exhibit? It's the Arctic Wolves. Yeah, yeah, that's a ton of Arctic Wolves. And that brings it up to 94. And that ought to bring theirs up. Alright. Suitability 94. Suitability 99. Oh, easy way. Yep. 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 I've got it. Literally, all that's left is waiting for the Tyrannosaurus's to breed. And all the research and conservation is done. And I'm keeping a pretty stable uh, animal and uh, guest happiness by having uh, happy animals. This is this is a better explanation than my than my uh, 
spoken one uh, in regards to the previous scenario. You can see there are animals on both sides basically everywhere. All right. So. Let me save. And I will uh, see you guys when the when I get a baby T-Rex. Congratulations, you've been given the gold certificate award most popular zoo for reaching the 1,000th guest milestone. Comes with a cash bonus of 25,000. Yeah, you know, the generic zoo keeper's fine. I'm, I hired a couple more maintenance workers. Or I thought I did, I accidentally hired two zoo keepers. But come to think of it, having a spare one's not a bad idea. So, I currently have one thousand one thousand. So I don't recall ever hitting a thousand before. Okay, everybody's giving birth except the T-Rexes. You. Your job is to make sure the T-Rexes are happy and breed. This is almost as bad, actually, arguably worse than breeding giant pandas. Lion 7 has given birth. Yeah, I, I'm i starting to think there can't be more than 1,000 guests. I have no way of verifying that. Oh, who is it? Is it the penguins? No. Is it the Arctic wolves? No. Is it the Mexican wolves? Is it the Komodo dragons? Oh, it's the lions. Alright, let's sell lion 11. And 10. 12. And now they should be nice and suitable. All I need is a baby T Rex. Yeah, I will see you guys when it happens. Status report. Year five. No baby T-Rex.
No baby T-Rex. Lots of things died. I, and I replaced them. But. No Tyrannosaurus Rex 3. And there, there's nothing I can do. There is literally nothing I can do to make them breed. Um, they had been escaping, so I put them in a pit instead, which has been working. I got everything else, just they're not breeding. We got the have. I, I have no idea how to boost the suitability of the exhibit. Um, because I don't think they like. Hang on. They don't like this, do they? No. They don't like any of the cheap tricks. No. Oh! Nope. Darn. What dinosaur poo are you trying to get to? Oh, there's still another thing of dinosaur poo there. I hired a whole slew of maintenance workers. And, um... I came back to find a whole bunch of broken... fences. Actually, these ones don't really... Uh, honestly, I might be better off removing that snowy rock formation and putting it, like, here. Because sometimes the woolly rhino would breed, and it would breed over here and poop. Like, when I... I, I went to go get dinner and I came back and it was full of poop. On a side note, I do have uh, 40 maintenance workers, most of whom are over here. I don't know. Oh, also. Oh, darn it. Uh, it is possible to go over 1,000 guests. I did C-1001 at one point. But, on the other hand, on the one hand, this is a very successful zoo. From a monetary standpoint. Also, I think I need another restaurant. Because... I feel like approaching $10,000 is roundabout capacity. So, I, no, no, I don't, because that won't help the T-Rex breed. I made sure they're not crowded by guests. I gave them the best possible exhibit I could give them. Hang on, what if... Okay. Somehow, it's possible to get it to 100. That didn't do anything, did it? Alright. Yeah, I think I'm going to try one more time to get the rock. Okay, they don't like that. Do they like any of the dinosaur digs rocks? They like the water rock? Done. Highland rock. Termite mound. 
Good. So I'll admit, one of the things I tried to do, I tried using the Dynaman cheat. That's D-I-N-O, Dino Man, not Dino Man. To see if I could perch, if I could cheat and get a uh, T-Rex to purchase. No, literally, they don't. They don't like any other rocks. So, Dino Man is a get, uh, you know, just in case I was wrong, and maybe it's a scientist, I don't think it is. So, yeah, I know I had unlocked some of these when I had done it before, but the T-Rex is not available. Actually, I should show using the correct code. Uh, you can see T-Rex not available. T-Rex not available. Heck, I even used the Dr. Doolittle cheat to try and get them to breed. I got a whole bunch of saltwater crocodiles. Also, this keeps happening. Monitoring zoo. Oh, there we go. Wait, you're going to fix a fence. But the issue is, they're so far away from the fences! I... I just... Okay. Yeah. They don't... Yeah, they don't want any more of that. What if... Nope. There, really, there, there's nothing I can do. The T-Rex just aren't breeding. I got everything else under control. Happiness frequently hits 100. Suitability of 97, which I know is good enough. Uh, to... Breed, because I've had T-Rexes breed before. And they're well fed. I have two scientists dedicated just to them. Plus, I have random other scientists. I now have maintenance. I have maintenance workers everywhere. I have zookeepers everywhere. Uh, the crocodiles are about to get. Uh, uh, they're going to need a culling. But no, I, I, I can't. Uh, I, I, I can't do it anymore. I have... I, I know as soon as I stop recording, they're going to breed. But th there's nothing I can do. Um, it literally is just really, really bad luck. Uh, if I have to, I will come back and sit here and work it out again. If not, this is going to go on the list of ones I either finish off camera or um, I might, I don't think, 
I need it for Ultimate Zoo. Give me a moment. Yeah, uh, I don't need to beat this to unlock any more scenarios. So this one might wind up actually being the marker for the final cheat I will be showing off. Ugh. Yeah, there's... Yeah, there's nothing I can do about it. Uh, but next time... Yeah. Next time we'll be doing the great... The Giant Marine Park. Anyway, this has been 18-2, and I will see you guys next time.